So when I first saw the pilot, yes. there were elements of your character that reminded me a little bit of Matt. Can you talk about that? Is that an Um, It's obviously, like, they're really obvious. But um, the difference for me, and I really worked hard because I had those comparisons with me when they were the game. Um, the difference is for me, Mac is, I love Mac here so much. She's very, um, she's very rebellious, but not, you know, you know she's really herself. And her true nature is just to go against the grain, do what she wants to do, and, you know, stand up with her friends and, um, cause trouble sometimes because of her. With Maggie, Maggie is much more of a, uh, I feel like Mac is naturally talented in things and she's figured out how to do things. Mac is a highly talented <laughs> So there's a different intention behind what she's doing. And I don't know why, but when I'm watching the, when I watch the episodes, um, I don't necessarily look at, at Maggie and Mac for all the time. Um, she's part of the support staff, so she's helping set up these deep cover operations and trying to keep it safe. Um, so there's not really room for that rebellious nature. It's like there are there are people's lives on the line here, and she's um, obviously she's had to work really hard to get where she is to be taken seriously. And, that kind of thing. So those are the differences that I really try to find and focus on. Because I myself, I, I could be attracted to like familiar territory. Like you know, it was important for me to see the differences. You know, for sure. Yeah. Um, so, I'm sorry, go ahead. Um, you know, this is kind of more of a tech position, yes. a little bit more office oriented, but do okay. you really want to have a, a part where you can kind of go in the field and have your character do stuff? And Absolutely. Um, I actually, because I didn't know, uh, the plot line of all of, of this entire series was very much so in the office. So, when I knew that we were going to start shooting like six months before, I started uh, training. And, um, I actually took the FBI PT test, which was insane. I mean, uh, I passed, thankfully, but um, it's really important to me because when you're playing these roles that are so far out of your own wheelhouse, like, never in my life have I ever been uh, anywhere near like law enforcement or all of those rules and regulations and, and whatever. And there's something really awesome to me about playing roles that you need to either make um, one of those sort of internal switches, uh, but it's awesome when you get to do the physical transformation. Not that that's where the character went, but I wanted to be prepared. There's something about even sitting in that situation room as Maggie, knowing that if, you know, something went down, I would know what a real FBI agent would do. Um, if you can't tell, like, my favorite thing of all time when I was little was playing protect. So this is a perfect job for me because... I don't have to go to school for any of this stuff. <laughs> so it's pretty cool. That that aspect of it was really fun for me. And, um, getting that physicality down, just so it, it makes you sit there. Like, like, I was so ready for a gun, man. <laughs> so yes, and I just went on a tangent, but I would love to have been like, you know, I want to shoot guns. I want to blow shit up, you know? <laughs> In a show where everybody is pretending to be something else, yes. does your character have any secrets? I'm sure she does. I definitely played that in, in my head. Um, it, that was what really drew me into the script, is this idea that I think that everybody in life, at some point or another, probably several points in their life, is like, who am I? What, why am I doing this? Why Why do I think this way? Why do I feel this way? It's a, it's a very human thing. It's a very human society. Uh, so we're not always 100% certain. We're confident within ourselves. And so uh, looking at that concept within the government and 
then like it's a really awesome thing to think about. Um, it's a slice of life that most people are not privy to. It's like what happens when these uh, agents or soldiers or whatever are sent into these extreme situations. Like how do you not lose yourself? How do you you know? So that's something that I definitely played into in my own head. It's very open ended. The whole show is like pretty mysterious. I don't absolutely know how to present who every person is. So that aspect is, is awesome. I love that. Yeah.